Biodiversity is the variety of species present in an ecosystem, and it's like the secret sauce that keeps our ecosystems healthy and functional. Think of it as a team, where each player or species has a special role to play. The more diverse the team, the better it can adapt to changes and challenges. This diverse team also provides us humans with lots of benefits, known as ecosystem services. Ecosystem services include obvious things like food and medicines, but also less visible services like water purification, nutrient recycling, and soil erosion prevention. Changes in our team's diversity or biodiversity can affect these gifts, impacting our lives. Now, let's imagine we are stewards of an ocean that's being affected by pollution. Our challenge is to maintain biodiversity and continue receiving our gifts, the ecosystem services. We could come up with different solutions, like enforcing stricter pollution laws, creating barriers to prevent dispersal of pollutants, or educating people about responsible waste management. But how do we decide which solution is the best? Here's where we need to weigh our options and evaluate these competing design solutions. We need to consider a few things. First, effectiveness. How well does the solution maintain our team's diversity and gifts? We can check this by looking at data from similar solutions in other places. Second, feasibility. Is our solution practical? Can we realistically put it into action, given our resources and technology? Third, cost. What is the price tag on our solution? We need to think about the money, resources, labor, and time involved. Next, impact. What effects will the solution have? We need to think about the potential ramifications of implementing our solution. Could our solution create other problems? Lastly, sustainability. Will our solution keep working in the long run? A good solution will fix the problem now and in the future. So, our goal is to find a solution that keeps our biodiversity team strong and our ecosystem gifts flowing. It should be scientifically sound, economically smart, and socially acceptable. This balancing act is at the heart of many environmental decisions and shows how important science is in making policies and decisions.